take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. If your iPhone alarm is not working, it's possible your alarm has been set to none. Open clock and tap the alarm tab at the bottom of the screen. Then, tap edit in the upper left hand corner and tap on the alarm that's not working. Make sure none isn't selected as the sound point 16 January 2019. Let's help you make your mark. If your alarm volume is too low or too loud, press the volume button up or down to adjust it. You can also go to settings, sounds and haptics and drag the slider under ringers and alerts. If your alarm only vibrates, make sure that your alarm sound isn't set to none. Open the clock app, tap the alarm tab, then tap edit point 26 January 2021. Make your mark, take our lead. Turn off your iPhone 11 or iPhone 12, it won't take long, just a couple of seconds. You'll feel a haptic vibration and then see the power slider on the top of your screen, as well as a medical ID and an emergency SOS slider near the bottom. Slide the power switch from left to right and your phone will power off. Point one nine February 2021. Make your mark, take our lead. Either take a screenshot of the existing alarm so that it's easy to create them again or note them down. To clear cache and data for the clock app, go to phone settings, apps, clock. Tap on storage. Here you will find clear cache and clear storage, data button point one four June 2020. Let's help you make your mark. How to make sure your iPhone alarm will go off. Open the clock app on your iPhone. Tap the alarm tab to open the alarm settings screen. Tap the on off switch next to your alarm to turn it on. If the alarm is off, it won't alert you at the designated time. Fix the time for your alarm if it's incorrect by tapping the edit button and then tapping on the alarm. Thank you for watching, please subscribe and hit the bell notification.